My name is Carol Heap and I am one of the founders of the Chestnut Centre here in Derbyshire. The Chestnut Centre was actually founded in 1984, but my husband and I had been keeping otters for 10 years prior to that. Our prime reason for starting the centre was to promote and ensure the conservation of otters, both in the UK and globally. And the secondary reason, which has actually become more important, is education. Education of young people. I have a view that if you get them committed before they're about 13, they will always have a, an interest, if not a lifelong passion for them. And that, to me, is conservation in its rawest form. <laughs> when we first started the Chestnut Centre, it was just mainly with otters, and we then had two species of otters um, and a few owls. Over the last 30 years, this has ballooned and we now have four species of otters, including the superb giant otter from South America. That otter has to be seen to be believed. Alongside that, we have now the European pine martin, European polecats, Scottish wildcats, foxes, um, and we have deer. We have over 50 deer on our deer meadow, uh, fallow deer and seeker deer. There is no way we can do what we do at the Chestnut Centre without a team of people behind us supporting us and those obviously are the animal keepers who not only are they just keepers of animals, they have a passion for what they do and an interest in promoting what we try and do. Uh, hiya, my name's Kirsty and I'm the senior keeper here at the Chestnut Centre. I've worked here now for 13, nearly 14 years. I started as a part-time keeper and worked my way up to full-time. Day-to-day routine is general husbandry of all the animals, uh, taking care of the park, um, all feed regimes. Uh, also, we have to look after any uh, wild, injured animals that have come in. Uh, any rehabilitation work. Here at the Chestnut Centre we offer a variety of activity days including beer keeper for the day, guided tours so that you get a chance to see the park in a different light. For 30 years the Chestnut Centre has been running as a good business which it has to do. For us to continue we depend as always on our visitors. We don't get grants from anywhere, we are totally and utterly reliant on our visitors coming to enjoy what we have and hopefully going away with a little bit more knowledge about conservation. Should you be interested in coming to visit us, all our information is on our website which is www.thechestnutcentre.co.uk. Thank you.